It was back to league action for Donegal D as they faced Bangor Swifts at the Fuels Arena on Friday evening. With top spot already secured, it was to remain unbeaten throughout the season was the challenge. Aidan Gordon got on the end of this dangerous cross here, but his effort was saved by Swift's keeper Joshua Gray. Bangor Swift threatened shortly after. Number 8, Paul McGuinness done well. He passed a teammate Matthew Rice. He advanced, but saw his shot saved by Jordan Ritchie. The team in yellow and blue did take the lead midway through the half. Adam Robinson capitalised on a mistake at the back. The ball made its way to Jake Cassidy, who coolly finished making it 1-0. Josh Blair had a go from this free kick. The Donegatty captain, seeing his effort, hit the crossbar. The Swifts came close to doubling their lead. Ryan Chambers had two bites at the cherry, his second a drilled effort deflecting wide for a corner. This delivery here found the head of Kai McPeak, the centre half setter going agonisingly wide. As the Swifts grew in confidence, Chambers saw this free kick just go wide of the post as his side went into the break deservedly in the lead. Donegal came out the second half much improved and Connor Caldwell's acrobatic effort went just over. However, it wasn't long before they equalised. This Leon McCulloch ball found Gordon. He cut it back for Jack Patterson to tap in. Just as they levelled, they went straight down the other end and conceded within five minutes. Blair caught out at the back, Paul McGuinness was put through and excellently chipped the keeper making it 2-1. Donegal E didn't stop there and again were in search of an equaliser. Patterson and Gordon have an effort. Credit must go to the Bangor Swiss defenders who put their bodies on the line time and time again. Donegal E's Josh Ferguson advancing from the right back position. He saw his shot saved by Gray. And the Swifts keeper along with the defenders were on hand again. 
before Ferguson dragged this effort wide. Banger Swift dealt with any pressure put on them by Donegal D. This crunching tackle here by McPeak, the pick of the defending. It turned defence into attack as this ball forward found Nathan Fisher. He controlled before sliding under Richie, making it 3 1, sending the Banger Fuels Arena into raptures. And that was all she wrote. Donega Day's unbeaten run ended as Bangor Swiss run out deserved winners following this 3 1 victory.